Hello, I'm Landis Fields. I'm here at the HP booth at GTC 2025. One of the nice little Easter eggs about even the title of this project, this little short film, The New Dawn, was that we're kind of entering this very exciting time as humanity, right? Like, it's not, you know, a coincidence that we're using the HP Captus powered by the NVIDIA Jetson to capture these real materials. It's the physical embodiment of the virtual world and the physical world. I always like to do a, a particular kind of like cohesive approach whenever I do one of these things. I wanted to write a screenplay, so I wrote a story about it. Um, costume design, went and sourced the real fabrics. Flight here, so I was able to capture some of the samples provided by Landis using HPC Captis and uh, Adobe Substance Sampler. So using these tools, you're able to capture more than just the color. In fact, you can capture the, all the nuances of the surface, right? All the surface details, even the transparency. And that way you're creating a perfect digital twin. So that the costume design felt more richer, but also we could drag those things in any type of application and they seamlessly look the same. We can bring them into Unreal Engine. We can bring them into Omniverse, anything. Yeah, so I collaborated with Landis here to work on the New Dawn short film. And my responsibility was working on the character and bringing the animation to life. Um, what we did was we took the sculpt and then we wrapped the topology using Z-Wrap. It's essentially taking all those landmarks from a human and then projecting them onto our stylized alien. And what was really powerful about that, the reason we wanted to go with a MetaHuman compliant character was so that we could take advantage of all of the MetaHuman identity maps, yeah. all of the um, real-time kind of uh, animation controls like Control Rig, but also the audio to face, right? You can use NVIDIA Omniverse audio to face live link with Unreal Engine. So we got all the animations for free, all the shader for free, and things that we could do in a normal standard pipeline that would take much bigger teams and much, much, much more time to create anything of this kind of quality. We also wanted to have all of the detail that you can see even here in this 3D print, uh, the different hand prints that we've done, all of that stuff tied in. What's really incredible about GPU accelerated workflows in real time is that whether you're using a Z8 workstation, the big desktop model, or you're using just one of the HP laptops, you're able to bring these realities to life. 